Magandang araw mga kasandok at mga kasyanse. Let's go oriental for the day. As I teach you how to cook sweet and sour chicken. This is Chef Ron, ang yung chaperon sa kusina. Tara, magluto tayo. First, what we're going to do is we're going to marinate chicken. This is about 500 grams of chicken. So any part of the chicken, pwede nyong gamitin. We're going to add in half a teaspoon of ground white pepper and half a teaspoon of iodine salt. So very simple lang yung recipe natin for today. Kasi sa panahon ngayon, syempre, kailangan magtipid pero importante masarap pa rin yung lulutuin natin. So we're going to mix and rub those spices na nilagay natin. You can also add garlic powder if gusto po ninyong maglagay. That is optional para mas medyo may lasa. Pero later on kasi dun sa sauce natin, maglalagay na tayo ng uh, garlic powder. Alright. So, standby muna natin to. And then, Hayaan muna natin siya na mamarinate for a while, like mga 15 or 20 minutes until manuot yung lasa ng, ng salt at saka ng ating ground white pepper. Next, gawin naman natin ang batter mixture. For the batter mixture, I have here 1 4 cup of flour, 1 4 cup of flour, and then I have here half a teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking powder. So we're going to combine this together. And then maglalagay tayo ng one whole fresh egg. Mix. And then about one fourth cup of water. One fourth cup of water. So itong butter mixture natin, Ito yung magiging, of course, yung coating ng ating chicken para mas maging malutong siya later on. You can also combine in, since 1 fourth cup yung ginamit natin na flour, 2 tablespoon ng all-purpose flour, and 2 tablespoon ng cornstarch. You can also do that. And then to season, I have here garlic powder. About half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Half a teaspoon din ng ating ground white pepper. And half a teaspoon iodide salt. And half a teaspoon of iodide salt. Continue mixing. So habang ginagawa natin to, kailangan nagpapainit na tayo ng mantika for our deep frying. To check if mainit na yung ating mantika, as you observe na nagbabubbles na yung ating toothpick, that's the time na pwede na tayo mag fry ng ating chicken. What I did with the chicken, yung marinated chicken natin is kinote ko na siya with our butter mixture. And then one by one, ipiprito natin to until maging golden brown in color. Sa pagpiprito ng chicken, make sure na hindi overcrowded yung pan natin. Kasi, para maging even yung distribution ng heat, especially ng oil dun sa chicken natin, para maging uniform din yung kulay ng chicken. And again, we're going to fry it up until maging golden in color. While waiting for the chicken, gumawa naman tayo ng sweet and sour sauce. For the sweet and sour sauce, 
It's going to combine here pineapple juice. Ito yung juice ng one can ng ating uh, pineapple chunks. And then I have here water. This is one cup of water. Light brown sugar. Light brown sugar, one fourth cup. I have here ketchup. This is about one third cup of ketchup. Haluin lang natin yan. And then hintayin natin na mag-boil yung ating sauce. Let's season our sweet and sour sauce with ground white pepper and iodized salt. One teaspoon iodized salt and half a teaspoon of ground white pepper. Half a teaspoon of ground white pepper. Let's continue to cook our sweet and sour sauce. And again, hintayin lang natin na kumulo yung ating sweet and sour sauce. You may also add a little more ketchup or kaya a little more sugar if hindi pa kayo masyadong satisfied with the sweetness ng ating sweet and sour sauce. And once na mag-start na kumulo yung ating sweet and sour sauce, we're going to add in about 2 tablespoons of vinegar. At this point, huwag natin siyang hahaluin para po maluto yung ating vinegar. So, hayaan lang natin siya ulit na kumulo further for about mga 1 minute or 2 para mas maluto yung suka, mas lumasa siya at medyo mag-reduce yung ating sweet and sour sauce. And after a minute or two, pwede na natin ilagay yung ating mga gulay. I have here red bell pepper, onion, and ginger. So at this point, pwede na natin siyang haluin. And then, ilalagay natin ang slurry. Ang slurry, ito yung pampalapot natin. That is a combination of about 2 teaspoon of flour and 2 tablespoon of water. So, para mas magkaroon ng texture yung ating sweet and sour sauce. Here's my slurry. So, immediately you will observe mas medyo lumalapot na yung sauce ninyo. And then, pakuluan pa natin siya until mag-reduce further yung sauce at mas maging malapot siya. At the same time, lumambot yung mga gulay na nilagay natin at mas lumasa siya dun sa ating sauce. Meanwhile, balikan natin yung chicken. For the chicken, importante is maging even yung kanyang kulay katulad na nakikita nyo dun sa other pan. Kuhanin natin yung mga chicken. So, I have your plate with kitchen towel. So, para madrain yung excess na mantika ng chicken natin. And then, let's continue to fry the rest of the chicken until maubos natin sa lalahat.
And since kumukulo na yung ating sweet and sour sauce, mas nag-reduce na rin yung kanyang volume. And as you observe, mas naging malapot na siya. That's the time, ilalagay na natin the rest of the gulay. I have your carrots. So it will add crunch, texture. Siyempre, kulay na rin. And then I have here yung isang lata ng ating pineapple chunks. So again, we're going to cook it more. Siguro about mga 3 to 4 minutes until maging medyo mas malambot na yung ating carrots. Yun. At mas lumasa yung ating pineapple. For the chicken, matatapos na rin yung aking chicken. As you observe, golden na yung kanyang kulay. And then, our recipe is ready to serve. Kung everyday ulam lang ang pinuproblema ninyo, tumutok na kayo dito sa aking YouTube channel as I teach you more practical, affordable, yet delicious recipe na po pwede nyong ihandog or lutuin para sa buong pamilya. For today, please hit like button and don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel. And also, hit that bell button para ma-update po kayo sa susunod na recipe na lulutuin ko para sa inyo. This is Chef Iron, ang yung Chef Iron sa kusina. Tara, magluto tayo!